Hello, this is a second look at the Tau Boot SPI bootloader for the Pinephone Pro. This is my developer edition and on this SD card I have uh, the installer image for Tau Boot Flash now. And if I insert the battery and turn it on. It should, after a few seconds, go through the bootloader and find that it should boot my SD card and then load to the graphical installer. And there it is. This is actually a tiny Linux image that's just running from memory and displaying this menu. And it lets you, in a user-friendly way, flash Tau boot to the internal storage of the phone. So if I choose install here, it will tell me to connect the charger. Um, that's probably smart because the battery is not very charged. And then I can start the installation. The installer deals with flashing the bootloader in a nice way, where it first flashes most of the image, but not the boot signature. This makes sure that if the flashing was incomplete, uh, the mask ROM on the chip in the phone will not detect this as a valid bootloader and not try to boot half a U-boot installation. And now it's done. Well, let's go back to the menu and power off. And that's it. it. Because it's plugged in, it will power on again and probably boot my SD card again. Yep, I get dropped back into the installer. Let's remove the SD. And power it up again. And now it's booting the postmark test installation on my internal storage from the new SPI bootloader that was just flashed using the installer. Thank you for watching.